beloved child. Allow me a moment of your time. This is not a mere coincidence that you are hearing from me now. Your heart echoes a deep yearning, and it's in response to this that I come before you. Let this be clear. I wish for you to have faith in me today and always, and may you never disregard my words. With the deepest love, I speak to you every moment, every day. My aim is to see you flourish, to bestow blessings upon you, and to let you feel the holy anointment I place upon you. Recognize that you have transformed. You are no longer bound by past struggles, mistakes, or the chains of those who belittle you and doubt your worth. Stand up, for you are freed. Escape the confines of your mental captivity today. I break every spiritual bond. You are no longer bound to harmful habits or the desires of those who mean you harm. You are my precious child, my beloved. My love for you is immense, beyond human comprehension, a mighty divine force rejuvenating your faith. Today, you will stand strong. You will rise, embrace, and joyfully accept the blessings I am laying before you. You will hear my voice in your slumber, feel my presence upon waking, and wherever you go, be filled with bravery. You will tread upon embers and remain untouched, even amidst the tempestuous sea's attempt to swallow you. Rise and proceed. Act now. Walk steadfastly on the water, step after step, keeping your focus ahead. Never lose sight of your aspirations, the beautiful destination you're meant to reach. Behind you flows my blessings like a powerful river, carving through valleys, flattening mountains, uprooting the deepest rooted thorns, demolishing barriers, and unlocking doors. These blessings are unstoppable. No power can thwart them. Wherever your path leads, my love will always envelop you, reaching the furthest corners, where you'll find my peace, grace, and blessing. My love for you is so profound that it challenges human understanding. Simply feel it, embrace it, and receive it with faith in the days to come. I will reveal my presence to you in extraordinary ways. Rest assured, nothing will be missing, for I have promised. I am your provider, ever watchful of your situations and needs. Do not agonize over your current trials. Close your eyes. Remember my teachings. Your mind and heart will be filled with peace and tranquility. Surrounding you are numerous opportunities, awaiting your action. Step forward and knock on these doors with determination and resolve. I urge you to do this fearlessly. I will guide your words when you speak. Make the choice today to progress on your journey. Do not be paralyzed by fear. As you stand and move forward, the windows of heaven will open for you. I will shower you with abundant, genuine blessings, and you will experience an overflow of provision. You will be liberated from debts and financial burdens, receiving more than you expect, enabling you to share, to give, to bless, and to invest. You will continue to harvest and sow, starting today and into the future, every day, every month, every year. Thus, revisit and reflect on these words until their meaning is crystal clear. Heed my command, immerse yourself in my teachings and move forward with purpose. It is time for you to awaken, for your faith to flare up, grow stronger, and accelerate. The plan I have for you requires leaving behind past defeats and guilt. Choose to persist, to fight each day, and ignore the whispers and attacks of others. Forgive, forge ahead, leave the past behind and progress. My words will protect you, your faith will be your weapon. I will help you navigate through any challenges you encounter. Resolve to endure, for I give you the strength to persevere. Remember, I am your shepherd, your provider. I am aware of your needs and will supply all that you lack and more. Declare with your words and your whole heart that you will continue to strive, to live, to believe. Do not be troubled by alarming news. I understand the purpose of my actions. 
I hold supreme authority. With my power, I can calm stormy winds, split the sea, enable you to walk on turbulent waters, raise you from sickness, heal your body, and comfort your soul. I collect your tears when the world inflicts pain and suffering upon you. In your faith, find shelter, love, and belief. My presence will envelop you again, filling you with love and peace in times of despair. Time alone cannot heal wounds. Only I can heal them completely, leaving no trace. Life's trials will not harm you. Rather, they have helped you grow and become wiser. I will also free you from the burden of painful memories. My hands were nailed to the cross, enduring suffering for you, cleansing your sins with my sacrifice, offering you my grace, and easing your heart's burdens and sorrows. In joy and in sorrow, in health and in sickness, my presence will never leave you. This is my solemn promise. I will perform powerful miracles in your life, demonstrating what's possible when my word is embraced and obeyed by a humble heart, one that accepts both trials and blessings. I will change daunting circumstances for your benefit. Challenges and tests will lead you to a better place. Conflicts will strengthen you, and you'll face situations that will grow your wisdom, if I allow it. This is for your good, and if I say, I will be with you and protect you from harm, it's because I will. You will prosper as I have decreed. Every good thing you receive will be multiplied and blessed. Believe without doubt, without letting past failures hold you back. If you believe in me with all your heart, also trust in my forgiveness. For full blessings, ignore the accuser. Pay no mind to criticisms or slander. Don't let them occupy your thoughts. Disregard the envious words about your future. Instead of fear and anxiety, feel my hand on your heart. Be filled with joy, peace, hope, faith, and confidence. I will infuse your life with joy and put praise on your lips. Your life will transform. Blessings from heaven will fill your home. You will be free from the chains of debt and past financial mistakes. Even in times of scarcity, Trust in my words and view your surroundings with faith. Stay alert to open doors and opportunities. Treat everyone you meet with kindness and respect. I will bring special people into your life to help you, just as I do. Be friendly, amiable, and respectful to all, for I will bless you and use you in ways beyond your imagination. In times of adversity, the wonderful things I plan to do with you Will become apparent. You will rise and shine amidst darkness. You will bear witness to this secret wisdom you are reading and hearing. I share it with many, but not all believe. And some reject my gifts. They make excuses and listen to those who keep them bound to misery, sin, pain, and sorrow, ignoring my blessings, words, and promises. But I tell you that I love you. Believe in me so you don't miss out on my blessings. I know you are different. I've seen it many times. I know you believe in me, and I dearly love you. Receive my blessing now. You are in my hands, under my protection. Fear not those who oppose you, for they will contend with me. Even though your problems are many, I will deliver you. Those who fight against you will be confused and shamed. Even now, you can see how they surround you. But I will intervene. I will help you. In a few days you will look around, and your enemies will be no more. Many are furious because they can't defeat you. They don't know or understand that your greatest friend, your God, your Savior, defends you. Believe and have faith, for with me nothing is impossible. Trust and act, for I am with you. Act and make progress, knowing that I have fortified your faith and given you the power to walk on waters. You will combat and overcome all evil forces, for fear no longer holds you. The anxieties and fears of the past are left behind. Lift your sword and persist in the battle. Prepare yourself for the blessings that are to come. You shall claim the land that lies before you. 
I will provide you with answers and solutions in every situation. I have anointed you with my spirit to heal and uplift many hearts. I will bless your family and bring peace and harmony to your home. Soon, you will notice a change. My presence will dominate your household. All the harmful forces that have caused distress will vanish and not return. Seek me, and you will find rest for your soul in my promises, in my word. Place your trust in me, for I am your God, your rock, your health, your strength, your salvation. Take my hand and never falter. I am your protector, your Lord, your healer. Proclaim now with all your might that you believe in me and hold tightly to your faith. I love you. I have been, I am, and I will always be with you. Pray for your family. It is essential, for your prayers are effective and powerful. You have seen many times how I have responded when my presence arrives. The challenges your family has faced have brought forth trials. You may see smiles on their faces, but inside they struggle. Come to my altar on bended knees. Start to intercede and plead. I will surround your family with a spiritual shield. I will not let the enemy harm them. I will rescue them from illnesses and accidents. I will endow them with wisdom. I will open doors that were once closed. They will discover many hidden favorable opportunities. I will provide you with strength, peace, calmness, and inspiration to speak lovingly to your loved ones. Never utter harsh words to them. Truly understand their emotions and the tough situations they face. When you are with them, embrace them tenderly, stroke their heads, and as you do, pray. My anointing will flow from your hands. My power will erase all sadness from their souls. I will break every chain and bring healing to their hearts. Share my word with them. Let my promises not be forgotten. In your home, my name will be spoken with reverence. You will witness the gradual resolution of problems, and my presence will prevail in your family. A time will come when you will joyfully witness the transformation in their lives. Their character will evolve and many who seem lost will find their path and reach their destined blessings. In these moments, it is crucial to hold fast to me. Do not be discouraged by the negative things you see. I have a grand plan, and my plan always comes to pass, unaffected by any obstacles. In your home, there must be someone who believes in me wholeheartedly, with true sincerity, praying for their loved ones with steadfast faith. You are that person. Pray for your family, and obstacles will fall. Victory will be yours. I love you, and I love them too. Find rest in me, for I hold your present in my hands, your future in my heart. The blessings that are to come in your life are proof of my favor, as long as you believe in and cherish my word. Those who wish to see you humiliated, will be astounded by the supernatural miracles I will perform in these days. I will lift your spirits, dry your tears, and bring you peace. I will fill you with joy. Come, engage daily with my promises. Open your Bible, sit in quietness, read and feed your hungry heart. Grow stronger, feel the immense strength that I am instilling in you. Sometimes you look up, hoping for a sign from heaven. But now I tell you to look ahead, for I am already answering your prayers and requests. I am granting you the things you have asked for according to my will, so that you may truly thrive, and your life may be filled with freedom and prosperity. The abundance I bring into your life will not be accompanied by sorrow. You won't need to accumulate debt or mortgage your future. No one can take away or rob what I give you. Do not see yourself as unworthy or feel undeserving of the blessings I pour into your home. They are yours. I give them because I love you and choose to bless you. However, be aware that the adversary will try to sow doubt, aiming to steal your blessings and dreams. I grant you wisdom to discern between those who give sound advice 
and those who deceive you with lies. They may use soothing words, pretending to love you, but when they see you caught in their traps, they will try to harm you. Be vigilant. I caution you to stay alert and avoid the snares laid by your adversaries. I promise to protect and watch over you. You must pray daily, and in doing so, I will envelop you in my presence. Persist in your faith in my word, and trust in me. I will encircle your home and family with my celestial forces. Do not let doubt invade your thoughts. My love for you is everlasting, and your life is cradled in my hands. I am here to help you overcome challenges, conquer discouragement, focus on the future, and maintain steadfast faith so you can triumph and flourish. Trust in me, for I am your Heavenly Father. Feel free to speak to me, confide in me, and express your needs, for I am your great friend, always attentive to you. My ear is always open to your voice. Sit and converse with me. Use your own words to share your thoughts, plans, and the depths of your heart. Voice your feelings, for talking with me heals your soul and instills peace in your mind. By verbalizing your emotions, you activate your faith and miracles start to unfold. Today is the day to tell me all you wish to say, but also to listen to my responses. I am not here to judge, scold or remind you of past errors. My spirit whispers softly to you, affirming my love for you, eagerly waiting each morning for you to awaken, to express your need for me and your love for me. Your words of love are your worship, your praise, rising to my throne like the morning sun. My presence fills your life with love and protection, reminding you that in your trials I am ready to help. I will not withhold any good thing you ask of me. Everything you seek for your blessing, I will grant swiftly, enveloped in my love. Entrust me with your thoughts, your heart. Hand over your concerns that are wearing down your faith and dreams, and surrender your worries that make you doubt my love. You need not endure these mental storms alone. Do not let the winds of despair drag you through the streets of sorrow. Whose voice will you listen to, the cries of despondency, the lies of failure, or the loving tone in which I speak to you? You don't have to struggle in anguish when I've shown you time and again that if you believe in my word, I will open the gates of heaven wide for you. You are my child, and my children do not dwell in darkness. My spirit is with you, offering comfort wherever you are in any place you find yourself. It's no accident that you're receiving this message. I've seen the toll that life's struggles have taken on you, how past adversaries have left you wounded, and the reason behind your ongoing pain. Yet I am here now, ready to save you from this anguish if you choose to embrace me. I aim to shield you with my wings and cover you in my shelter. I urge you to listen closely, to read my words attentively, and to take them to heart. For I earnestly request your belief. I do not want you to suffer any longer. Your current trials are not a sign of my wrath or retribution. My love for you is deep and everlasting. I am here to lift you up, to heal your despair, and to lead you out of failure. You must rise, even if you feel weary, even if your heart is still aching and carrying the weight of pain. Take steps of faith, trust in me again, and you will experience miraculous healing the moment you decide to believe in me. Each step you take will bring you strength and complete healing. Stand up now, for your life is about to change, and tomorrow will be different. Why? Because I love you. I am with you. And that is all you need to understand today. You might feel downhearted and sad, but as you read and listen to my words, your heart will be filled with peace, joy, encouragement, and faith. I ask you to remember my tender love repeatedly today, yet do not linger on the painful experiences that have scarred your life. A new era of restoration and recovery is approaching. 
you will see the return of lost blessings, and I will open doors that were previously shut. From heaven I will shower you with numerous blessings that will bring prosperity and comfort to your soul. From this point forward, walk with confidence, knowing that I, your God and Heavenly Father, filled with love for you, am always by your side, igniting the passion to live a purposeful and meaningful life in your heart. Embrace the fervent desire to obey the commandments of your King and Lord, and never feel ashamed to believe in me and my word. Rejoice in the wonders I will perform in your life and for your family. All who believe in me have the right to be heard in my presence and to reap the rewards of their faith and obedience. Anticipate extraordinary and wondrous miracles soon, and you will see many positive changes in the lives of your loved ones, filling you with happiness. So even amidst challenges and occasional hardships, remain assured that I will never abandon you. I will be by your side in every moment and situation. I am here to assist you, and with confidence and faith, you can speak to me. However, it's essential that you also take the time to listen. Immerse yourself in my written word. Through it, I will reach out directly to your heart, infusing you with my spirit. You'll discover a strength that is unshakable, a gift from me. Commit yourself, promise me, that you will seek me every day with love and faith. I will be there, waiting for you. Know this, I love you deeply, and this is certain. I have come to communicate with you, to touch your heart at this very moment when you need me most. My love for you is boundless, sincere, and everlasting. Nothing, not even your own mistakes or sins, can sever you from this immense love I hold for you. Even in times when you felt distant from me, my tender hand was extended, rescuing you from that which bound you and dimmed your will to live. Whenever you call on me, I am here. When you cry out in your darkest hours, I open the doors of my heart wide. Seeing you kneel, my eyes look upon you with kindness, and my grace envelops you. Though your journey may take you through perilous and bitter paths, my presence will shine brightly in your life, dispelling all darkness. Even before your birth, I knew you. I selected the precise moment of your arrival into this world, and nothing in your life unfolds without my consent or blessing. While you may not always understand or appreciate my workings in your life, one day you'll see that all I did was for your benefit, to fortify you, to foster your growth, and because I always have greater plans for you. My intention is to elevate you to higher realms of faith and dedication. I desire to place a gleaming sword in your hands, so that when you declare my word, miraculous events will unfold around you. Do not feel unworthy of what I am eager to accomplish in you. Cast aside those doubts. Recognize who you truly are, a child of the Almighty God, a valiant warrior filled with resolve, strength, and destined for triumph. Believe this for it is the truth born from embracing and accepting my love. You are not meant for defeat. Beyond these trials, which you will surmount through your faith, awaits the glorious blessing of victory. Amen.